morning. Mind if I look a little shiny in this pic? I have myrrh on my face trying to get this hair straightened out. Or unstraightened out. Uh, Mosea 8. King Limhit spoke many things, told his people about the brethren that were in Zeremia. He caused Ammon should tell what happened from the time that Zenith went up out of the land until the time he came up out of the land. He spoke to the people of King Limhi, the last words of King Benjamin, that they might understand. Then he dismissed them home. He caused the plates be brought before Ammon to read them, and as he read it, King inquired if he could interpret languages because there are more plates that he could not read. The king was grieved for the affliction of the people. He caused 43 to go in the wilderness that we might appeal to our brethren to deliver us from our bondage. They got lost and found not the land of Zrema, but returned back here, having travailed in the land of many waters. They discovered a land covered by the bones of men and beasts, ruins of buildings, lots of people. They brought back as a testimony 24 plates with engravings of pure gold and large breastplates of brass and copper, perfectly good and sound. The, they brought back swords, the hilts perish and the blades are cankered with rust. None is able to interpret the language on these things. Can you? Do you know anybody that can translate it? For I am desirous to know of a knowledge of the people who have been destroyed. I would like to know the cause of their destruction. And Ammon said, I can surely tell thee of a man who can translate records, for he has wherewith he can look and translate all ancient records. It's a gift from God. The things are called interpreters. And now no man can look except he be commanded. Whosoever commanded to look is called a seer. Behold, the king of the people of Zeremia had this high gift from God. King says, a seer is greater than a prophet. Ammon said, a seer is a revelator and a prophet. There is no greater gift. A seer can know of things which are past and which are to come. By them all things revealed. Secrets made manifest, hidden things come to light. Things not known shall be made known, things which otherwise could not be known. Thus God provided a means that man might through faith, work, mighty miracles. Therefore, he is a great benefit to his fellow beings. Ammon made an end of speaking. The king rejoiced and gave thanks to God. There is a great mystery contained within these plates, and the interpreters were prepared for the purpose of unfolding mysteries to the children of men. Oh, how marvelous the works of the Lord! How long does he suffer with his people? They are blind will not seek wisdom. They don't want that she should rule over them. They are a wild flock which fleeth from the shepherds, scattereth and driveneth and devoured by the beasts of the forests. Okay, join me again for Mosaic 9.